Hey gamers, it's Winter Mute here from Grind This Game. Uh, checking out this new game called Breath Edge. Uh, seems pretty cool. I think it's by some Russian developers. It's kind of like Subnautica, but you're in space. So I'm going to start a new game here. I'm playing it in 4K and it looks just amazing. So I tried it out for a little while, but I'm going to start with a fresh, uh, fresh playthrough here. Looks like standard mode is the only mode available. So we'll go with that. Now the intro is pretty long. So if you don't like intros, um, you probably want to skip ahead five or ten minutes. <laughs> but we're going to go through the intro anyway, just to get the backstory here. And there's some pretty funny stuff here. Some of the humor is good, some of it falls a little bit flat, but... Searching for the font. Half the development time, yeah. Now this guy looks like Heisenberg from Breaking Bad. I think these guys are coffins. Uh, the Red Ruins Softworks team is categorically against smoking, which causes loud... Oh, I think there's supposed to be voiceover here. I'm not hearing the voiceover. Uh, okay, let him... Uh, let's do censorship. Here you are again. Did you have time to think of how to behave during the interrogation? Remind him, R2-D3. <laughs> I guess he's the enforcer. You tell us all you know from the beginning. No lie. Confirm? Okay, gonna spit on him. But I think we're wearing a helmet, so <laughs> we spat on ourselves, basically. You tell us all from the beginning, or violence. You tell us that you fly to the funeral, but the liner explode radicals of green universe. Confirm? Okay, I'm gonna just tell him, tell him the story. Yeah, it's a big, big ship. It is a little bit choppy. Because I'm playing at 4K, I think. Oh, we're in a, we're in a shuttle. There's Grandpa. And the chicken. Green Universe, Broccoli Attack. Okay, I think every game starts with a crash scene. And that was it. So much for that. Uh, I think this thing carries coffins. I think it's like a spaceship full of coffins. Chapter 1 Lost in Space. You lied to me. Logo was impossible. Could not see the shuttle from space. Tell truth. No lie. Confirm. I guess our story was too good. Okay, we're gonna tell him the unembellished story now. <clears throat> I guess we the unembellished story is when we, we just get knocked out right away. Try not to urinate on electrical appliances. Okay, we'll try that. Chewing gum. Greetings. I'm your funerary spacesuit's built-in guide to the world of space funerals. Before we start communicating further, confirm that you are still able to read after the impact. Uh, yep. I can still read. Splendid. You've gotten into a non-standard situation. The Breath Edge Global Funeral Agency is proud of its impeccable history. However, your death may cause the loss of its reputation. Therefore, we suggest that you stop the gas leak and survive. Okay, we gotta plug this gas leak. Uh... What can we use here? Where'd that chicken go? Let's get that chewing gum. Whoa, we're in we're in zero G here. 
When picking up any useful items, you can stuff them in your pockets, calling it an inventory, if you will. Okay, let's check our inventory here. chewing gum from your pocket. I'm gonna bind it to slot one. You have to get your funerary spacesuit sticky while holding the chewing gum in your hand. Stick it somewhere except for your face. <laughs> okay, where's my chicken though? I want to try the chicken, but I don't think I have them. Anyway, let's try the chewing gum. You deserve some words of encouragement. That's impressive. You've almost won. Okay, that looks, uh... The funerary spacesuit isn't designed for long-term use of persons or animals in outer space. It is recommended to immediately call for help on the interphone, <laughs> improve the spacesuit, or become depressed. That looks pretty nasty. Okay, out here. Let's take a look outside. A source Ooh. of increased radiation is detected. Probably this is the central core of the liner. Be careful. The radiation will kill you instantly in such a suit. Okay, so we got 45 seconds of breathing. We got eating. We got drinking. This looks really amazing in 4K. I was playing in regular resolution when I tried the game out in a lower re resolution, but... When you discover a new blueprint of an item, it is automatically added to the memory of a processor in the kitchen, where you can create this item using the necessary resources. Probably. Okay, the voiceover guy's a little bit chatty, but... I'm uh, I'm liking the look of this. Now, we can't stay out here too long. Let's go check out our spaceship. Oh, one tip. If you hold Alt down, it makes it so you uh, don't float around as much. It kind of stabilizes you. Grandpa's mug. Let's take it. Now, I probably won't read all the, all the commentary and stuff. All the descriptions. Feel free to pause and check it out. Got some ice. See, if you hold alt, it's nice and stable, but if you don't hold alt, you kind of... It's very uh, uncontrolled movement. I'm just going to pick up a bunch of stuff here. Metal, ice. Metal. Can't stay out too long, though. Let's get back inside. That's not the entrance. Okay, let's check out our, our little home home here. Got the old water closet. We got a calendar here. Grandpa loved and carefully collected such things. Okay, uh, I'm gonna take it. What's this? Stand. Can't use that. Okay. Water closet. Okay, we got different music here. Let's try switching the music. Got our light switch. Let's check this out. The waste disposal system is damaged and is operating in reverse mode. The toilet can suck objects flying past the shuttle when the tanks are full. <laughs> reverse mode. That sounds uh, scary. Okay, let's not use it. Scan. We can't scan that. We need a scanner. What do we got here? A pillow? Got a roll of fabric. Looks pretty nice in here. We got some chiku chiku belch. This is, I'm just gonna grab everything here. Grandpa's picture. Didn't want to part with his chicken. Got a uh, VCR here. Insert videotape. Okay, I don't think I have any videotapes yet. Alcohol. Survival guide. Oh, okay. Take that, and I wonder if I should play it. Maybe I'll play it. Uh, yeah, let's just play it. It'll take a little a few minutes here, but okay. Insert videotape. Uh, where is it? Videotapes. Ads. Okay, here we go. Nice music. To pee or not to pee. Space, so dangerous, so unpredictable, just like your bladder. Oh no. Oh, what is that? Oh, nasty. Oh, 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 oh. This is wrong. <laughs> Okay, this is kind of useful. Use uh, use your mask, I guess. Okay. Oh, oh! Don't 
pee in space. Be cautious. Okay. Oh, I love how the chicken's farting his way along there. <laughs> Don't get electrocuted. Use the chicken. Okay. We're learning. Can cook her chicken. Hopefully this music isn't too loud. Looks like the hidden toilet. Yay! Someone's got really bad aim. The end. Okay, that was fun. I just wasted two minutes of your life. Okay, let's uh, remove the tape. I'll well turn that off. Okay, let's see what else we got here. What's this thing? A processor. Okay, this is where we make stuff. Uh, let's make some water. Mix two, two water out of two ice. We can make some equipment. Enhanced spacesuit. We need a bunch of stuff for this. Helmet, tools, alcohol, refined metal, roll of fabric. Okay. Okay, we'll come back when we got more stuff. What do we have here? Dog beer. Physics. Okay. I'm just hoarding everything here. Let's see what else we got here. Can't scan that one on the scanner. Looks like looks like there's a item there. Oh rubber, okay. Oh those bed sheets look a little bit nasty. <laughs> got some photos. Grandpa's picture. Oh, I didn't mean to take it. Oh well. I got a bunch of photos. I'm not gonna look at everything, because that'll take some time. Let's check our inventory here. Let's go out into space and see what we can see. Okay, what's this? Tip recorder. We need we need a handy scrapper for that. Same with that. What do we got here? More ice. Nutritious goo. Oh, we can make a nutrition package now. Good. Because we're going to get hungry soon. 23 seconds of air. Just, maybe I should head back. That warning's a little bit, a little bit loud. Okay, we'll get some air and head back out. Back out we go. Okay, what else? Got lots of lots of ice. Let's head over here. Ice, ice, baby. Uh, metal pillows. Judging by the primary analysis of the destruction, most of the passengers of the liner died. This might be the biggest catastrophe in the history of astronautics. The reasons for which are yet to be clarified. Got tons of food and water here, and some dead bodies we can toss around. Okay, I better get back here. Oh, we got got some wire. Okay, I'm gonna run out of air. Back, I must get back. Now you don't die immediately, but you start taking health damage. Okay, this station. Too much. I like the calm music more. Oh, we got a blueprint. Drill blueprint, let's take that. Some news. Feel free to pause and read it. Line, but the probability of the liner crashing due to a terrorist attack is 65%. Chicken. <laughs> Can't see if we can make some food here. Takes nutritious goo and ice. Make a couple of those. We make anything new here? I want to make a drill, I think. But we gotta collect some more stuff. Let's head back out. Maybe I should eat something. Drink something. I'll eat later. Back out we go. Back that place was pretty good. I think there's some more stuff there. 
back here. Now it is, it is a uh, uh, zero G, so it's pretty easy to get nauseated. So I'll try to not spin around too much. What do we got here? Container. We need a. We really need a handy scrapper. Metal. Oh no, a coffin. Open. Oh, we need a crowbar. Oh, we're gonna <laughs> run out of air. Back we go. Oh. Where'd that gelatinous goo go? Quickly get some air. Head back out. Okay, there's a little... Uh, let's just keep collecting stuff. Okay, we got metal. Lots of metal. Uh, what is that? Plastic. Need a scrapper. Okay, this looks like more wire. What's that over there? Oh, what's this? Need a scrapper. Back we go. Oh, I think I might be taking some damage here. Six by four. Oh, we made it in time. Good. Now the little fist. Six meters away. Oh, okay. What do we got here? Interphone. Let's use this. Just the antenna. You'll have to go into outer space. Okay, we gotta go check the antenna. Uh, we're good for food and it's just so nice outside. I think that was behind us. Oh, yeah, back over here. Oh, we got lots of stuff here. Okay, where's that antenna? Down here, I think. That was a close call. Try to adjust the antenna very carefully. Okay. You've got great engineering skills. You have broken the antenna completely. <laughs> now you will need some special equipment and interphone activation codes, which are encrypted in the memory of the steering wheel, if it's still intact. Okay. Gotta find the steering wheel. Get back, get some oxygen. I guess I don't have to come all the way in. Back out we go. Let's find that steering wheel. It says it's over this way. Oh, there's lots of little things here. The sensors report the presence of some nearby cooling gel. Its microscopic particles can settle in the glass of the spacesuit, forming some beautiful frost work, which can lead to visibility deterioration. What is this? It looks like the steering wheel. You need to try to connect to it. Al alkali supply. Okay, steering wheel. Let's... Great news! Using my ingenious two-digit password matching algorithm, I managed to hack the interphone activation codes. Now all that's left is to build a cryptographic debugging station and reconfigure the interphone using these codes, which will take about five years with your current skills. <laughs> is that all? Okay. Back in we go. Remember that you are still able to become depressed. Let's see if we can make that thing they're talking about. Equipment. Tools. Crypto cryptographic debugging system. Metal, wire, we can make it. Let's do it. And our inventory is getting pretty full. Okay, anything else we can make? Uh, refined metal, let's make one of those. We've got tons of metal. Okay, let's try to equip that thing we just made. Cryptographic debugging station. If you're sure that this is exactly what was on the blueprint, then try to reconfigure the receiver. If you have any doubts concerning it, then you will eventually suffer an electric shock, and then your spacesuit will automatically take your body measurements to order a coffin from our company. Thank you for choosing the Global Funeral Agency. Oh, uh, the humor in this game. Okay, let's debug this thing. Oh yeah. That's some serious debugging. Okay, let's call for help, okay. Attention survivors. Rescue shuttle Hope was sent free from the nearest... The rescuer's oh. arrival time exceeds your estimated lifespan by 4,369 years. You need to get to the extraction point yourself, getting past the radiation. However, it's impossible to do this with your current skills. To increase your level, you need to create some crap imposed by the developers. Of course. 
Let's, uh... Let's offload some inventory. I think this is some storage up here, so let's... Put some stuff in there. Uh, what kind of offload? Maybe some ice. Some goo. Let's put all these papers and stuff. A chicken picture. Oh, this music. It's hilarious. Physics. Okay, that sounds good. Let's eat and drink and head back out. Or actually, maybe can I make something new? The handy scrapper. Oh, okay, cool. Babe is calling us. Incredible. Survive one. I see your avatar online. It's quite the uh, photo. Let's make a handy scrapper. It wasn't possible to determine the coordinates of the survivor. Communication only works on reception, which gives a good reason not to respond and not to be distracted, despite the objections of the hormonal system. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's equip that thing and go use it outside, try to find some new stuff. Okay, I think we can use it on this thing. Okay, it's floating away as we hit it. Okay, that turned into some metal scrap, I think. Another one here. More metal scrap. Did I miss one piece? I said I wouldn't turn around too fast. Okay, back in we go. And I think there are some cases we could open, so I'm gonna go try to make some open some cases. That was over this way. Get some gelatinous goo as we go. Okay, here it is. Oh, was, that was just plastic. Okay, I think there's some cases in here somewhere. Oh, that babe keeps calling us. Okay, here are the... Break container. Your interlocutor has a very sweet accent, causing fatal errors in my grammatical functions. Okay, we got a battery. Got some rubber. Better head back, get some air. <laughs> Now, I think there's items you can upgrade to get more air, so we'll be trying to get those. Back up we go. Okay, oh, there's a radio or something here. Tape recorder. Okay, we got plastic. Getting lots of good stuff. I think it's telling us to go over this way again. Or maybe that's inside. Oh, I think that's inside. Okay, what can we make here now? Oh, thick electrical tape, roll of fabric, composite resources, stations. Crap imposed by the developers. Okay, refined metal times two and thick electrical tape. Okay, let's make this. And refined metal. I think we need two of those. Now, I don't want to use all my metal just yet because we need to use this scrapper's got durability and it's getting worn down. So let's make another scrapper. Oh, we can make a drill too. Oh, what to make, what to make. We'll go outside and collect some more stuff first, and then uh, come back in. Oh, babe keeps calling us. Okay, what's down here? What's this purple, purple thing? Oh, there's lots of stuff on the way. Okay, we'll grab this first. Oh, that only took one hit. Okay, I'm gonna run out of air, but what do we have down here? Looks like a bed. Judging by the degree of decomposition, this subject died long before the catastrophe. We have a murder here, Sherlock, and we just have to ignore it. Just have to ignore it? We got a hammer. 
a hammer covered in blood. Kay. The victim is also stained in blood. Probably the hammer accidentally got stained by the victim. I'm running out of air. Oh. Gotta get back. Uh oh. Four, three, two. Oh, we're taking damage. Taking damage. Okay. Now you can heal yourself in this bed. Oh, there's a back scratcher. Grab her. Okay, let's let's rest. I think that uses up some eating or uses up some food and drink, but okay, we're almost almost done. Okay. Back up we go. Oh, was there stuff there? Extract plating. Shears, okay. Get some more metal here. Oh, looks like there's more wire up there. Stuff everywhere. Okay, that's where we were before, but I'm gonna run out of air. Okay, I'm all turned around here. Okay, back to the shuttle. So we need a way to hold our breath a little bit longer, I think. Okay, what else can we make here? Uh, drill, grabber. Let's try a drill. Actually, is there anything else here? Oh, the thing from the developer. Where was that? Can't remember. Objects, stations. Oh, this thing. Crap imposed by the developers. Hmm. Okay, let's make it. What are we supposed to do with it? Can we assign it to our hot bar? Yes, I think I'm supposed to use it on this. Oh. The electrical stimulation is complete. Having traced your brain's activity while you were working, your brain was stimulated with small electrical charges to improve your engineering skills. Judging by the result, it didn't work and caused a number of hallucinations. <laughs> However, it was entertaining. You still can't get past the radiation, but I will mark the coordinates of the rescuers for useless motivation. Oh, nice. Okay, we can hit ourselves. Uh, let's try that. <laughs> oh, man. Concussion. Oh, we're actually taking damage. Uh, let's install it. Confirm. Yes. Okay, that did not work. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to install it. Okay, we gotta rest here. Uh, cause we just, like, lost a bunch of health. I guess you really shouldn't hit yourself in the head with stuff. I'm not really sure what that unlocked. I think it was just, uh, trolling us. Okay, fully healed. Uh, let's... Let's go back outside, try to find some stuff. Okay, so they're marking where we're supposed to go. That's really far away. We'll never make it over there. Let's go see what this is. It was a dead body. I don't think I saw everything I could see around here. Okay, got a case. What's this thing? Some drugs? An unknown substance with a suspicious name. Whoa. Okay, what do we got here? It is unlikely that he suffocated from this. Being in a spacesuit, where oxygen is sufficient for an entire full breath. Okay, we got some stuff here. Shears, let's head back. Where the heck is my shuttle? This way. Probably could have timed that a little bit better. Oh, we're actually pretty thirsty too. Oh, taking damage, taking damage. Don't die. 
cosmonaut. Okay, we can make shears now. Let's see what those take. I think we need some food pretty desperately, so let's fix it. Food and water. Now, they'll probably add the ability to make more than one at a time, I hope. Okay, tools. Shears. Metal wire and scissors. Let's make those. I think we needed those for like the pillow things outside here. Okay, shears. Let's equip those. And... What are we supposed to do with this crap imposed by the developers? Install. Where do we install it? Let's just try it here. Okay. Don't think that's really where it's supposed to go. Maybe we'll find out where it's supposed to go later. Okay, let's eat and drink. Yum, yum, yum. Okay, the shears I think we can use out here. On these... Whoa, on these pillows. Or whatever they are. Okay, we're getting fabric. And we're using our shears up pretty fast, so maybe I should save them for better stuff. Oh, that music is hilarious. Okay, we haven't gone down this way. What's down here? Oh, babe keeps calling us. Toilets detected. Some of our clients are very sensitive toilet. to toilet talk, and therefore we included a dictionary. Judging by the amount of joy around, this is the debris of the liner's public toilet. This means that there may be large reserves of water from the shower tanks nearby. The main thing is not to confuse them with liquid waste tanks. Uh-oh. What was this? Dead hamster. <laughs> I propose to call it Hammond, although this toilet doesn't look like a man robot. That's nasty. Okay, we're going back. Uh, where's the shuttle? Up this way. <laughs> Definitely need an item to hold on to more oxygen. But I think I'm going to wrap up the episode here. Didn't, didn't want it to be too long. We got some stuff done. Next episode we'll keep exploring around. But this game looks pretty cool. Uh, this music... Uh, turn that off. Turn that off. Oh yeah, now it's nice and silent. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, this is pretty cool. I'm, I'm liking this. It's a pretty nice looking game and it seems like there's lots of stuff to do. Uh, so we'll uh, continue on next time. And as always, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time.